So a lot of you guys are probably wondering why I am wearing a, a, a hat inside, and um, to, to be quite honest, I really could not tell you why. Um, just kidding. It's cool as sh** in my room. My channel recently has been a lone, scarce landscape without Don Travis Fudge. It really has been like a wilderness without uh, the beast Don Travis Fudge uploads. And for that very reason, Don Travis Fudge is hitting your sub boxes right here, right now, in this video. This is going to be the return of Don Travis Fudge. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Oh, wait, 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 Jibs, you can't start a Don Travis Fudge video without giving us some type of breaking news. Breaking news here in Indianapolis, rookie middle linebacker Don Travis Fudge had some Reese's Puffs this morning. That's it. He had some Reese's Puffs. That's about it. Nothing to report on. He didn't uh, abuse his wife, have an affair with Cam Newton's wife. Um, he had some Reese's Puffs. And that will conclude today's news. Thanks for watching. Okay, like I said before, we did do one video so far in this series, and we did, uh, actually, excuse me, we've played two. We are one and one, actually, uh, as the Colts with Don Travis Fudge. We do have the Browns next week, so that's going to be a good matchup. Hopefully, everything goes well in our favor. The first couple games, I was playing with the inverted camera, so it was, like, uh, all messed up, and I'm really not good at that camera whatsoever so I, I finally figured out how to switch it over to like the normal camera view and let's just say user picks are about to happen there's going to be user picks on top of user picks we already got one pretty sure we already have one on the season we actually do i, I remember getting it um but like i said we do have the browns who are zero and two we are one and one let's check out our stats really quick before we get into this game just to see where we're at for the season because like i said we have not done this in a while there is don travis fudge six solo tackles two assists eight total tackles two tackles for loss and two interceptions we actually have two i'm underestimating Don Travis Fudge and his beastliness, but without further ado, like I said, we do have the Browns, so let's get right into it. Dunkin' Donuts might honestly be the best pl best place on the planet. I literally go here every morning. Uh, I get the frozen mocha coffee. It literally makes my eyes roll into the back of my head. That's how good. It Gotta warm up, dude. It is freezing outside. You guys want to see something crazy? Look at this thing. You guys probably can't see it. It's disgusting. I know, right? It's called a freaking callus. My, I don't think you guys realize how bad this hurts. Like, it, that cut is literally so deep. But yeah, it's from gaming too much. So like I said, our offense is actually not too bad. I felt like it would be pretty rough, uh, obviously being the Colts and whatnot. But our offense has actually done pretty well so far this year. Look at Don Travis Fudge. He's an absolute beast. He just stands out in the crowd look at how big he is can you imagine going up against a linebacker like that i know i would not be able to we have our, our zone right here don't throw that deep post he's gonna throw it deep and that's an easy interception no let's go baby no now we gotta throw a block now travis fudge like i said he used to be a what he used to be a running back in his uh, past life but he can block so First and 10, offense was able to put up three points on the board. We're manned up with Najoku right here. People who underestimate my man abilities, um, it, it's, it's just not good. You can't do something like, oh man, we missed that tackle. That was rough. I kind of feel like I kind of feel like bringing the blitz, but at the same time, I don't want to screw myself. We got a little vert hook zone right here. Let's see if we can catch him off guard. Watch out for the inside zone. We're right here. Don't throw it over here. And that's the Sean Kaiser fumbling. Picked up by Jabal Sheard. What a huge play. Let's go, baby. Defense is on fire right now. The Browns can't do anything on the Colts defense. Honestly, it's not a matter of whether we're going to beat the Browns or not. It's, it's, we're getting a shutout. That's that's the goal for this game is to try to get a shutout. Break off that block. Chase him down, Fudge. There we go. We get the nice tackle from the backfield. Colts 2017 draft class. Don Travis Fudge, Mary Harden Baylor represent, dude. Probably the best player in the league, to be honest with you. First and 10, I don't agree with this blitz, so we're going to audible out into cover two. We got a QB spy right here. I really hope Deshaun Kaiser tries to run it on me. He's running it on me. Deshaun Kaiser's running it on me. <laughs> I mean, I would slide if Don Travis Fudge was coming 90 miles per hour at, at, at your head, too. Second and five, manned up on Isaiah Crowell. Wherever you go, Isaiah, I'm coming with you. That's the Don Travis Fudge effect, and we're picking up a block, and he's getting tackled in the backfield. See, what a lot of people don't realize is... Even though if, 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 not, if we don't get the tackle necessarily, we're still uh, getting blocked and we're freeing up somebody else. So that is obviously very good. Third and six. Can't allow them to convert here. Let's base a line and predict pass. I'm assuming they're going to pass. Get this zone right here. Don't throw it right here. Don't throw it right here. And the curl route's going to be open. First and ten. What do you got for me, buddy? You better not run it up the middle. That's all I got to say. He's running it up the middle. No! Oh! What a play by Don Travis Fudge, that is huge! Let's go, baby! That is called filling the gap and making a shoelace tackle. That, that, that's really all it is. Believe it or not, Don Travis Fudge actually did vote for Donald Trump in this year's election. And he uh, he does regret it as of now, but that's a little bit too late, isn't it now, Don Travis? 
Deshaun Ka Ooh, Deshaun Kaiser's getting me a little bit bad. I want him to get cracked. And we're going to hold them to a fourth down and get the ball back for our offense. And they're going to go down and score once again. Like I said, dude, our offense is doing very good. I know it's the Browns, but still, our offense is definitely the weak point of this team. And as long as we can keep getting uh, th three and outs uh, for the Browns, then I don't see why we can't hold them to a shutout. Deshaun Kaiser just loves throwing it to where I'm not at. He, he just loves throwing the ball to where Fudge is not at. Like, he... If Fudge is on the right side, he's, he's not even going to throw it anywhere near him. And I mean, I wouldn't either. He is. Oh, we got a blitz, baby. We're coming right off this edge. Watch watch and learn. We're coming right off this edge. Get in there, Fudge. The pressure's coming. And Deshaun Kaiser is getting destroyed. Let's go. Deshaun Kaiser cannot do anything, dude. Our defensive line is getting unbelievable amounts of pressure. And that's huge. We got to keep it up on defense, obviously. Holding them to zero points in the first half, which is huge. I'm, I'm assuming that he's running it up the middle. And he, oh, he didn't run it up the middle. <gasps> oh, we just got lucky, boys. Oh, man, that could have been very bad. This is a crazy blitz right here. Watch and learn, ladies and gentlemen. This is what I like to call the freak blitz. It's it's the freak blitz. Oh, my God. It's not really a freak, freak blitz. It's more like a 10-yard a gain blitz, but it's a blowout here in Indianapolis. All we got to do is keep up the pressure on defense. And that's... Th what did Isaiah... What? <laughs> I'm going to need to read this Exploring Psychology book to understand how, how that play just happened. Don Travis Fudge just got tabletopped by that freak. <laughs> Alright, we cannot allow them to get in field goal range. Having them score field goal is basically like losing the game for me. That's how I'm looking at it right now. Third and five, big stop right here. We got pretty much, we're in cover two drop right now. Pretty much everybody covered. They're going with the screen. And uh, Deshaun Kaiser's going to scramble. Somebody crack him, please. Thank you. Offense doesn't score us any points, but they do leave the Browns in a good field position for us at least. First and ten on their own eleven. I feel like they're going to keep giving the ball to Isaiah Carell because that's really all they can do. And we were almost there for the pick. If we played that a little bit more conservatively, we probably could have got that. That is Don Travis Fudge baiting to show Kaiser. That is a huge play. Let's go. Don't test the user, dude. Oh my god, that is huge. Third pick for Don Travis Fudge on the year. And he's a middle linebacker. Have, just keep that in mind. That is called baiting the young rookie the, the young rookie quarterback. I apologize to Sean Kaiser, but you're going to have to learn your lesson sooner or later. And it looks like he just did. And he's still confident. He wants to run on us. I want to crack Deshaun Kaiser. Oh my God, Deshaun Kaiser's—he's getting real confident now, throwing to within Fudge's vicinity. Um, I mean, if he has to learn his lesson again, I'll gladly do it to him. Darn it, dude! That's all on us. And and the Browns just <laughs> cue the cue the sad music. Cue the sad music. The Browns just scored. A touchdown on our defense. Just let that sink in. The Browns just scored a touchdown. I completely forgot Fudge is right here, dude. We are bound to block an extra point in some time in his career. It's going to happen eventually, dude. He's just going to reach up there and destroy. He's probably just going to snag it out of the air, to be honest with you. Oh, man. <laughs> that ball literally went through Don Travis Fudge's hands, dude. Uh, okay, so like my goal obviously on the season is to be the interception leader, but it's also you really can't be the like the leading tackler like with the way the computer is like made. Um, it's just the amount of tackles that you get as a user isn't even comparable to like the computers. They just get an unbelievable amount of tackles at the middle linebacker position, at any linebacker position, and there's really nothing to do about the tackles. But I can do something obviously about the picks, um, and that is shown so far. <gasps> oh, who I want to know who that is. Who is that? Who just dropped that? That is not Travis Fudge. Let's go. Let's see what's going to happen. Oh my god, let's go. That is huge. Four picks on the season for Don Travis Fudge. He's just too good, really, dude. He, there's really not much I could say. There's Deshaun Kaiser. Uh, <laughs> how does it feel knowing that you threw two picks to the... Uh, 
the best middle linebacker in the league, Deshaun Kaiser. Don Travis Fudge is having a heck of a season so far, and we do improve to 2-1, and one, which is even better. Jacoby Brissett led our offense to a very good very good game, putting up 20 points on the board. I think it was 20. Um, but anyway, the Colts are obviously improving, as well as Don Travis Fudge. Uh, four picks on the season so far. We probably have like 10 or 15 or so tackles, something like that. But like I said, if you guys have any recommendations for Fudge, if you want to see him on a different team, if you want me to adjust the stats and whatnot, like what you guys think I should uh, spend my XP on. Let's see how much we have. We have 2,000 XP, so I'm just going to save on, so hold on to that for now. But if you guys have any recommendations, let me know. And then, like I said, if you guys have any recommendations for news, because like you guys know, I, I do like the news things with Don Travis Fudge where something happens before the video. If you guys have any recommendations for that, let me know down below. Let me know down below because uh, I'll probably feature it in a video. But yeah, thanks so much for stopping by today, boys. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you are new, make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe if you're new. But anyways, hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I'm Gips, and I'll catch you guys later. Peace. I should probably take this hat off now. It's like 90 degrees in my room.